Greetings, and welcome to Lowry's Look at Literature. Yes, I know you're wondering, Lowry, where's your new bling? Well, sadly enough, our financial situation has declined. No bling this week. Just old bling. Old bling bling. Old bling bling. Yes, as many of you can tell, ta-da, we are no longer in the wonderful world of HD. We have returned to Normal D. Really? Normal D? That's what you could script for me? Oi. Well, shall we look at books? Shall we? Look at books! First, we will begin with The Great Pacific, number one. Yes. A book? Right there. Look at it. A book that combines the world of comics and, of course, a environmental message. That's right. You have an island of garbage the size of Texas in the Pacific Ocean. Think about it. Garbage. Texas. How fitting. Hmm. 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 Well, the next book, I, I must say, you must go out and purchase this book just to encourage Canadian content. That, and they are somewhat friends of the Madness, Inc. Shall we look at Heroes of the North, number two! <coughs> oh, I so enjoy Canadian heroes. Yes, interesting characters. Well, that's it for now. And once more, need I remind you, Lowry needs more bling. Leroy needs pants. Farewell. Go look at books. Bling, bling. <laughs>